Ducky and Diane, how y'all doing? I should check on that table. How y'all doing? Can I get you two anything? Miss Chan, here at last to relieve our suspense. Interesting. Hi. I am Reginald McAllister, the third, Ducky, to friends, former entrepreneur, now retired, and this young woman is Diane. Hey there. Nice to meet you. I didn't realize that... Uh, that we all knew you were coming. Well, yes. Don't cut me off. Gabe is generous with uh, both friendship and information. You're from Portland, right? I moved here from D.C. six months ago. How are you finding the small town thing? I, I don't know. I just got here. I'm going to just lie and say it's perfect. I didn't really know what to expect, but it's kind of perfect. <laughs> it feels like a home. I know. I know. I really thought I would hate it. And I saw the mountains, met some people, and now I'm never leaving. Diane is a geologist, recently working as a process manager for Typhon Mining. I'm glad there's another newbie around here, too. I'm weak. Can I get you anything? Oh, yeah, we're super hungry. I'd love a pie special with fries. Cheeseburger with mushrooms, and my usual to drink. Jed will know what to do. All right, I'll go put that order in. Thanks. This nigga eats a burger with mushrooms? What a freak. Haven is nice. Just wish it felt like home. Hope we both get there soon. Oh, so she kept it. Is she gonna say the Haven same thing? Is nice. Okay, yeah, she is. Just wish it felt like Hey Dad. Yeah. I've got an order from Ducky and Diane. Go ahead. Cheeseburger with mushrooms in his One usual drink. With mushrooms. And the uh -huh. usual yeah. drink. Pie special with fries. One pie special with fries. Ducky asked for his usual? Yes, yeah, sir. He did. Yeah, he's fond of a particular rye whiskey. I keep a personal bottle for him. Oh, that's good man. Odd. I don't see it. Oh, now wait. I bet Ducky took that bottle upstairs last night. Yeah, he and Gabe went on carousing long after closing. Oh, yeah? Yeah. Serves him right if you ask me. But feel free to go upstairs and look for it. I'm sure he'd be grateful. I'll go do that right now before I gotta go clean that back oh, and go talk to if bro. If you can't find it, Deputy Pike was with them. Might have some idea. Deputy He's Pike. usually in here around now. Probably arriving soon. Appreciate that, Jay. I'm gonna go check upstairs and see if I can find the bottle. There must be something around the Black Lantern that can help me find Ducky's prized whiskey. Well, we about to go upstairs right now and figure it out. Let me go upstairs. I'm a, I want to find the drink first before I go talk to bro back there that I just, you know, his whole washing set is messed up. So, you know what I'm saying? I'm going to go back there and clean. He's going to be like, why you do that to me? Yeah, All right. Yeah, 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 yeah. Let's see if I can find Ducky's whiskey up here. Ducky's whiskey. All right, man. Let's see. How about we chat the chicken? The chicken. The, the kitchen. How about, how about we check the kitchen? Oh, my Ooh, gosh. Now I know where the ramen is. No whiskey, though. Copy that. It's probably in the fridge, though. I can't check the fridge. Very interesting. Maybe Ducky left his whiskey up there? Nope. Nothing. Fucking pain. Of course it wouldn't be that easy. Why would it be? Who's that? I'm really happy for you, Gabe. Oh. Oh, on top of here? Yes. This all looks really fancy, but no rye whiskey. Oh, brother. We gotta go upstairs again? Um, that's the sculpture. What about the, there's nothing over here. Let me see. Nothing right there. And that's just a water bottle in a canteen. And I can't go upstairs. Yeah. 
Uh, I see nothing. Uh, we can double back one more time, but I don't really think there is anything. Looks like all BS. No rah. It's kind of ass. We can't look in the fridge, though. Like, what is that? We got a puzzle. It's missing one piece. Yeah, that shit is not up here. All right, well. Send it. Okay, that look like just regular shit. Well. All that look like cleaning supplies. Yeah, it ain't up here, bro. We gotta wait for bro. We gotta wait for bro. I don't know, that motherfucker's not up here. I'm sorry about that, ducky. There must be something around the Black Lantern that can help me find Ducky's prized whiskey. I still want to hit the trails later this week? Let me see. You kidding? This one's from yesterday. Hold up. It was Colonel Ducky on Gabe's couch with the bottle. Colonel Ducky on the couch. Where the couch at? Wait, there's a couch upstairs. I'm fucking stupid. I ain't see that. I ain't see it. What? I ain't, I ain't check the couch. Don't tell me that motherfucker is hidden between the cushions, bro. Hold on, bro. Fucking wow. I am I'm truly weak. Well I guess I didn't take the couch. I'm I when when the, the picture was on there, I'm picturing the bottle sitting sitting on the couch and not in it. Found this upstairs. In Gabe's couch? Really? Must have been a night. Interesting. Many thanks, Alex. My pleasure, Ducky. Can I pour you a glass? Uh, no, no. Allow me. Nigga is geek to have that bottle still. To Miss Alex Chen, a most tenacious detective. To Alex. Cheers. Ain't supposed to be drinking on the job. Oh, too late. Oh. <sighs> that shit ass. Ugh. Glad you could fill in today. Of course. All right. So now that we My dad was Wakanda a forever. All right. Time to go clean the back. Oh, these niggas playing dots. Ooh, shit. It's bracking, bro. Shit. Now Max scared. Well, you shouldn't have came in here beating his ass. You should be. At least he's not freaking out anymore. He won't make me lose control. Shouldn't have came in fucking swinging. Yeesh. Glad I'm not a 19th century miner. Damn. Haven seems pretty proud of its mining history. Clean up these bottles since niggas wanna leave and shit. What's up, bro? Holy oh, shit. Oh, shh. Back, bro. Can I talk to you real quick? What's up? What do you want? Listen. What happened upstairs was fucked up, right? From both of us. Where are you going with this? Look, Riley's headed over here. She's pretty heated. I, I, I don't think it helps to recap all the gory details, you know? You want me to, you, you want me to cap? So you're saying you want me to lie to cover your ass? No, no, just like, let me handle it. Look, she's gonna break up with me otherwise. Shouldn't have been accusing, bro. We've been together four years. 
She is the best thing that's ever happened to me. So please, help me out. I, I don't know, man. They're gonna give me a choice. Shit. What the fuck is wrong with you? Oh my god, look at your face. No, it's okay. Don't even. What were you thinking? Where's Gabe? Why do you give a shit? Oh, brother. Because my boyfriend just got into a fight with him. I swear. This is it. You better have a good explanation or... We're done. They're about to give me a choice. It's not my fault. I just wanted to talk to the guy. About what? About you! About why you guys are meeting behind my back. Okay. Just tell him the truth. So how did the fight happen? The bastard sucker punched me. Okay, um, not exactly sucker punched, but he definitely started it. Oh God, were you there too? Okay, so... <laughs> I don't... Look, I just got here. Alright? I don't feel like... I don't feel like capping for a nigga that just ran in here and accused her of something that she wasn't doing and accusing my brother of doing something he wasn't doing either. Because, look, if I lie and say that he started some shit, Charlotte gonna be pissed at him because she. I said that he started the fight, but he really didn't because he got hit, he he got ran up on and got beat up on. And I'm a lie to her and him and hers. That's three people I'm lying to versus the one motherfucker that I just now met that I clearly don't give a shit about, and he caught the hands for me. You shouldn't have been accusing, bro. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I'm gonna call you out. You shouldn't been. You should have been. You should have been. You should have yeah, been accusing. I was there. Max telling you a whole lot of bullshit. I'm not covering for you, bro. You I don't what? know you. That doesn't even surprise me anymore. So what really happened? Tell the truth, bro. That's all you had to do. Mac barged in, accused Gabe of sleeping with you, sucker punched him, and then kicked him while he was down. Riley, listen. What happened to Mac's face? I beat the fuck out of him. Put the hands on him. I did that. Oh, good. It sounds like he deserved it. Thanks for telling me the truth, Alex. Wait, wait, are you, are we okay? No, are you no. fucking serious? I'm so embarrassed by you right now. But are we still together? What do you think, you fucking idiot? No. Alex Chen? Uh. Assaulting Mac Loudon on your first day here, huh? Assaulting? I'm Jason Pike, the deputy sheriff. I'm gonna have to take you in for questioning. What? What about him? Mac he... assaulted Gabe. He's the one you want. I'm defending my brother. What are you talking about? <laughs> your face. Boys, <laughs> but you should see your face. Oh, jeez. <laughs> Oh, I'm only kidding. Uh, nobody's in trouble here. I, <laughs> Gabe and I just like to prank each other. <laughs> <laughs> I've never been pranked by a cop before. Yeah, that's real funny. You definitely got me. <laughs> Thanks for being a good sport. Can I buy you a drink? Um, maybe. I'm working right now. Well, I'll be at the bar. You want one, you just come by, okay? <sighs> Yeah, that's nothing to joke about, especially if you're a cop, bro. Come on now. Dude, like, like, don't do that. Don't do that. Do I still need to clean up? Is there shit out here that I need to get? Oh, she also said there was hints about him. 19 Damn. lives? Jed is a real hero. Damn, bro. Go. 
Coupons for weed? What a time to be alive. I'm weak. How mysterious. I think that's it. See, Harmon must be Charlotte. This is really cool. Oh, so she is like an artist artist. I'm thinking, I thought she was talking about like music wise, not like artistic and drawing wise. It's cool to know though. Oh, he's pissed. Damn boys, always okay. fighting. Still the same. Time to grow up. What he got to say? Damn, was that drank out of wine? Did I come on too strong? It yeah, was bro. I'll give you that. You did. Are you finished up with everything you want to do? Yep, I got you, bro. That's everything yeah, on the list. Yeah, I took care of everything you mentioned. Is there anything else you'd like me to do? Nah, the boys should be back soon. Well, speak of the devil. How you feeling? Not great. Not awful. I got Alex covering for you. For real? Yes, sir. You're welcome. We need to talk. I'll be on the rooftop, okay? Okay. I think that's enough for today. You did great work. You'll be a damn fine addition to our team. So how much am I getting? You can't keep an injured man waiting. You better go upstairs. How, but how? Before we leave, how, how much we'll am I getting? Uh, Jed, how how much is my check? Time to talk to Gabe. Jed. I mean, I'm not gonna get that much. What's good, y'all? Welcome back. How's your jaw? Is the pain bad? Look, Gabe, I'm really sorry. I... Say nothing, bro. What? I... Did you rehearse that move? No. Only in my mind. <laughs> so, need a manager for your underground cage fighting career? Gabe, I'm Nigga. really sorry. How many bones have you broken? Like, on other people? Dude, I'm so sorry. I didn't mean to hurt you. He worried about Mac. He ain't worried Don't about apologize. himself. I'm fine. Now that we're talking about it. Guess I never realized. That I'm a crazy person? No, come on. I never realized what your life must have been like. On your own. It was fine. You know, when I pulled you off the Mac and you hit me, I, I was angry. Then I thought about how you took him apart. Like you've done it before. Probably have, bro. Kids in foster care fight a lot. I learned how to defend myself. 
I'd say. I can tell there's something going on with you. Something troubling you. Maybe it's time you open up. I want to talk to Gabe, but what can I even say right now to explain what happened with Mac? Oh, shit. Um, just might as well just let him know because that was the only reason I reacted that way. I, I mean, might as well tell him the truth before some crazy shit happen and he finds out on his own. I feel like we can still tell him about his past and this. Off. About me. I know what other people are feeling. I can see these auras around them. And if they feel strongly enough, if they're angry or sad or afraid, I feel it too. And then I lose control. And this has happened? For a long time. Like Mac. I felt all that anger like it was my own. I think it was pretty clear that Mac was angry. It's more than that. He wasn't just angry at you, he's angry at himself. He thinks he's gonna lose Riley. Did Riley tell you that? No, no one told me that. I just feel it. Sure, it's not just, you know. It's not just in my head, Gabe. I promise. It's not from meds or stress or trauma or whatever. It's real. Can you tell what I'm feeling right now? It doesn't work like that. It's only when you feel really strong emotions. Oh. I don't expect you to believe me. No one does. So you can actually feel what other people are feeling? Yes. You're like going inside their heart. I guess I am. Dude, you have superpowers. <laughs> You're fucking with me, right? I'm serious. Did you listen to anything I just said? This is terrible. Okay, okay, maybe superpowers is a bit strong. It's just... I have no idea what's going on with people half the time. Charlotte's teaching me how to improve my emotional intelligence, but this, this is on another level. You can get in there. I mean, that's, that's really special. Special. That's really your take on all this? Totally. I mean, it's whatever you make it, right? But it doesn't matter what's going on. I'm here for you. Don't forget that.
Aww. That was sweet. So, when were you going to tell me about the guitar? Oh, shit. You found it. It was supposed to be a huge surprise. Surprise? <laughs> well, what do you think? I love it. Thank you so much. Of course. Welcome home. Oh, hey, dude, what's up? Hey, is Ethan up here? No, he was heading home. He was, but I haven't seen him in a while. <sighs> I told him not to wander off. I'll find him. Gabe, wait. Earlier, when I was talking with Ethan, he told me he was hiking up the mountains to explore the old mine. What? Why didn't you say something? I'm sorry. If he actually went up there, we need to move. Now. Okay, let's go. Oh yeah, that nigga's dead. See, that's how games and movies go, or TV shows too. You know, when something good is flourishing and happening, you know, they're confessing love or, or people get back together and they tell the truth about things. Something bad has to happen. It's just the only way the story can progress. Something bad needs to happen, and this is it. And Ethan might get packed up, if we're being honest, you know. He might be dead because we didn't tell him. We didn't snitch on him, basically. And uh, I think I made the wrong call, but we gonna find out. Hopefully he's all right. Ethan? Ethan? I look, you forgot oh about God, him, to God. be honest. This nigga's probably stuck under a Alex. rock or some shit. This way. Damn, Gabe, you coming or what's what's up, bro? Wow. Been a while since I was up here. Should I be, I don't know, freaking out right now? In my experience, freaking out is almost never advisable. Any luck? In touch base with the safety team up at the site. They're going to postpone tonight's blast until we find them. Oh, at least we're not racing the clock. Hey, you good? Charlotte's got to be losing it right now. Hey, she's tough. Always has been. Come on, let's take a look around. This kid. Can you imagine the shit we would have caught from Dad if we'd done anything like this? I should have... said something earlier. I didn't... I mean, when he said he was going to the old mine... Alex, it's fine. You couldn't have known. It's not your fault. Yeah. Still I mean, I, I, I could have said something. You would have caught on to it. I'm going to go take a look around. But I'm glad Maybe you're no, understanding. any sign of Ethan. I'm glad you're sure. understanding to an extent, you know? I can do that. But I need to find out exactly what happened that night for myself and for Gabe. Oh my god. I feel like I should warn you though. You might not get the kind of closure you're looking for. But if I use my power, 